Yo, what's good? It's Only Entertainment TV, and we are back with another Dead Frontier video. Another, 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 another Christmas edition. Um, I, I had a uh, a fan uh, comment. He he or she asked me when I was going to do the Santa's Little Helper, um, you know, kind of review, and that will come after Christmas because I want to open 150 Christmas gifts or more. Um, on Christmas, and you cannot get the Santa's Little Helper without opening the Christmas gifts because um, you need the wrapping paper and, and all that. But um, I said in that comment that I would be doing the Santa's Little Helper and the Chimney Sweeper uh, review after Christmas, but I forgot that you could just buy the Chimney Sweeper, so that's what we're going to be doing today. We are going to be testing the Chimney Sweeper out on Santa. Um, for those of you who don't know, he has 5,000 health. Um, I am playing in single player mode right now with no boost. The only boost I have is a 35% speed boost, and then I will pause the video and I'm going to put on a 35% damage boost just so you can kind of get both, you know, things. And it's just minimal critical damage. I did not, when I reset my character so the way I could use the, um, the shotgun, I did not add any critical hit because it's kind of useless because the shotgun has zero, zero, zero critical hit chance anyway. Um, so, no critical hit on this. Um, I just have it basic, no damage upgrades or anything. As you can see, it has insane fucking knockback. I mean, like, if you, I mean, you get caught in a crowd with this thing, just open it right the fuck up. Not, not even a problem. So, um, you can buy the chimney sweeper for a thousand credits. Um... I, like I said, I don't have any critical hit on right now. I am playing in single player mode. I like to keep myself in multiplayer mode um, because you know if if somebody wants to play or they you know they see me, I I, I like to play with them. But um, I did single player mode just so the way we can kind of get a fair uh, you know little thing so none of the zombies are hit by anybody else. It's all me. Um, yeah, as you can see, the the knockback on this thing is dirty it's so disgusting it's like when you're when you you're younger and you curse and your grandmother slaps you in the fucking face with that wooden that wooden spoon and you just go fucking flying well at least i did my grandmother's a bodybuilder uh for those of you who don't know no she's not i'm lying i just tried to make that joke work um regardless the, the fucking knockback is insane um if you're if you're the kind of person that just i mean runs around and just fucking wrecks shit this is the gun for you. Uh, I'm going to be honest. It takes 10 gauge ammo, which is not that fucking expensive. 10 gauge is very, very inexpensive. Uh, I don't know about right now, considering the chimney sweep just came out. But I have to assume that within the next week or so, ch uh, 10 gauge will be even cheaper than it is now. Especially with the 200% um, uh, you know, uh, ammo loot. That is, that's definitely going to be a thing. So, um... My knowledge on the Chimney Sweeper is that it does more damage than the um, x Manberg. I believe it does, uh, like if you hit all of the shots that come out of the spread, I believe it does 274 damage, um, somewhere around there. So it, it is a very good gun. Um, as you can see, it's just, it's just taking care of fucking business. I mean, you don't even need help. You don't even need to run. And nothing can get up to you. You just fucking walk around the things that come behind you, and you just blast them the fuck back that way. And since it's a shotgun, you're pretty much guaranteed to hit at least one shot, so somebody's going fucking flying. You know, I, I, it just spreads, it absolutely takes care of fucking business. If you're a shotgun person, and you're, you know, you're somebody that wants to, you know, run around and just fucking take care of business, this is the gun for you. It's a little expensive, it's a thousand credits in the shop. Or, I believe it is 2.75, or not 2.75, but 27.5 million in um, in the marketplace, at least at Sekernon Bunker, which I believe in credits, that's about 1,037. So right now, I don't know if they'll go down in price, but right now you're just better off buying the gun. And I mean, as you can see, it, I mean, it does kill things. Uh, it's kind of hard to see me kill things because when I kill them, as you can see, like, they just go flying. Um, all of these little mobs, they just have a couple hundred health, so they get taken out pretty easily. Um, I'm just waiting to see if... I'm just, I want to kill one of the uh, Santas before I put on my 
uh, damage increase. Was that one of them? I can't tell. There's only four on my screen now. I think that was one of them. Hello? No, I don't think it was one of them. Otherwise, it, it could have been, and I might just not be able to loot him, but I don't think it was one of them. I mean, I there's nothing else to say about this fucking thing. It's wicked. I, I should have moved out of the way there, but I wasn't paying attention. I was paying attention to my uh, my energy and my experience. Absolutely wicked. I, I wonder how this would work on, like, like, a, like an actual boss, like a Titan. Maybe not a Black Titan, because they're pretty quick. I don't know how the knockback would work on them, but... The, the fucking knockback for this gun. As you can see, two-shot kill for the uh, for the big exploder. And and like I said, this is just minimal critical hit. The 25 that they give you at the beginning. And you could just sit here. Like, I haven't moved. Like, I just sat there and, and shot off five shots. Nobody fucking near me. This is a great gun. This is a really good fucking gun. Um, I would definitely recommend... Oh, that's Santa down. That's Santa down. Okay. I'm going to reload here, and I'm going to open my inventory. I would definitely recommend this gun to any shotgun person, and it's definitely worth the uh, the credits that it costs. Okay, let me just make sure. Okay, I'm just checking. I'm just checking. Okay, so I have my 35% damage boost on now, so we'll see how this fares. Now, granted, most of these, uh, most of these Santa zombies have been thoroughly beaten to death. But I mean, it, even with the like, even with the fucking thirty-five percent damage boost, they, they just d get destroyed with with or without it. They get destroyed. Um, I'm just an idiot. I can't. Apparently, I cannot stay out of harm's way. <laughs> uh, you know, nothing's gonna help me. Apparently. Um, let me go back to this sand and loot his ass. Cause I'm trying to. I'm trying to get these presents. You feel me? And I mean, look at how far away you can hit that. I mean, I mean, and my accuracy. I didn't even raise my accuracy that much. Cause I mean. You really don't... Where the fuck did he go? I mean, he they just fly. He's never going to touch me now. Never going to touch me. He's just going to keep going backwards. This gun... I cannot express how good I think this fucking gun is. Um, I'm probably going to stick shotgun class from now on. Uh, just because... I mean, this gun is fucking disgusting. In a good way, though. Uh, I can't wait to see... I, again, I cannot stay out of fucking Harden's way. I <laughs> It, I, it doesn't help with the uh, with the exploders just because you know they blow up before they get knocked back. Um, so it doesn't help with that. But I mean, at the fucking it's absolutely insane, absolutely fucking insane. I mean, I'll just take these guys the fuck out right here, no fucking problem. So, like I said, I believe this gun does about 274 damage. I'm never going to be able to loot that just because of the, the spitters that are there. I'm going to have to try and take them out. 274 damage. When you multiply that by 35%, that's probably around, like, man, I would say maybe 360 damage per shot. Don't quote me on that. I'm not, a, like, a mathematician or anything, but around that, uh, that, that area. So, super OP. Um, I like how, you know, they're releasing these new guns for the seasonal, you know, kind of stuff, and, and they're better than the guns before. I was kind of afraid that this gun wasn't going to be as good as, you know, some of the other weapons, um, but they're, they're just fucking fine. Um, I'm gonna get, uh, information, whatever information I can get on the, oh my god, they just go flying on the, um... Santa's little helper uh, without watching any videos because I don't want to watch any videos. I want our experience to be the same. Uh, so whatever it does, however much damage it does, uh, I will figure that out, you know, with you guys. But I want to, I mean, like, like, uh, oh, fucking Jesus Christ. They came quick. They came in, they came in quick. Am I, I'm just stuck in an infinite loop with all these guys. I cannot fucking, cannot loot them. It just takes him out. Absolutely destroyed. Great gun. This was a this was a great addition. They 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 did they did something good here. I'm just I'm still getting beat the fuck up, man. I'm I'm so I'm so bad at dodging those those fucking things. I'll take like a training course. I'll get better. I'll get better. Uh and ten I mean ten gauge isn't even that fucking hard to find. And let's be honest. You find that shit anywhere. 
Except, like, Nasty's hideout. But, I mean, like, around second on Bunker, you find that shit fucking anywhere. I'm, I'm just constantly stuck in an infinite loop now. I'm gonna die. I'm busy. I'm too busy fucking around. I'm gonna die. Don't let my... <laughs> Don't let my trash gameplay, uh, like, you know, persuade your opinion. Hey, if this is an absolutely disgustingly good fucking gun. Oh, and Santa did die over here. And, um, I don't think I mentioned the stats on the gun. The stats on the gun are 4-4-4. Four, four, and four. Um, that's how you buy it straight out of the, uh, straight out of the credit shop. So, um, that's how I bought it. I didn't do anything else to it, and, uh, you know, I wanted to keep my critical hit bare minimum just because it has a 0% critical hit chance, uh, anyway. So, and most of the guns that I use, Scar 9000 has a very low critical hit rate, and this has a very high, um, critical hit chance, so it, it like, it was like I didn't really need to, um, to do all that extra stuff. So, um, my trash-ass gameplay aside... This is a very good gun, very, like, overpowered amount of knockback, you know, if you, if you could actually play the game, unlike me, um, you, you'll be doing really fucking good with this thing, and I, I mean, you know, experience-wise, it's a great fucking grinding weapon, I could see you going to fucking town with this thing on, you know, like, like the Santas on the Santas and, and, and fucking everything else, I could see you just absolutely whipping ass with this gun best shotgun so far um the firing rate isn't uh too slow but it's not super quick um but it's like it's just enough you know like if it i feel like if it were any quicker it would just kind of ruin any chance of you having a legitimate game experience because it would you know it'd be too fast and they all you would have to do is shoot the zombies would never get near you um but I feel like it's the proper speed, and, and I mean, it just fucking destroys everything. Look at that. Just down. Can't even get to me. Oh, man. This is, this is a good fucking gun. I'll be keeping Shotgun Clash just for this gun. That's disgusting how good that gun is. I'm serious, like, my, like, my, like, my, my, oh, my goodness. <laughs> I was gonna say some shit, but then I was like, maybe I shouldn't say that on the internet. <laughs> uh, but regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Um, I give it a, an A++. This is a really great gun. It switched me over to shotguns. I'm not usually, a, like, a shotgun clash just because they're super loud. But I am trying to level up, and it's just, it's just so fucking good. Um... That, I, I mean, I just, I have to switch. If that means anything to you, this is the fucking gun for you. I mean, it, it just completely switched my entire mind on uh, shotguns. So, um, you know, great fucking knockback. It, 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 it's super strong, does a lot of damage. Um, I'm going to try and test it out on some other bosses just to see how the knockback kind of works with them. Um, but, of course, that won't come until after Christmas because... Or well, after January fourth, because there are not there's not going to be any other bosses that spawn, um, other than the Christmas bosses, and obviously they're not like a Black Titan or anything. So, um, if you enjoyed this hit this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the share button. Definitely leave a comment. Positive and negative doesn't bother me. I just want to see some feedback. Um, and if you enjoyed that much and you can't wait to see the Santa's little helper inter uh, interview, <laughs> I'm gonna interview that fucking gun. I'm gonna tell you what, uh, you can't wait to see the Santa's little helper review. Um, and you, you don't want to miss the 150 plus, uh, Christmas gift, uh, opening. Be sure to definitely go on and turn on post notifications so way you can notify every time I upload a new video because you're not going to miss what is next. Thank you guys so much for watching.